Uh, this is our group. We're presenting on Ad Taxi. My name is Leo. My name is Luke. My name is Vienna. I'm Alethea. I'm Chomley. And this is our presentation. Yeah. So we're going to have Chun Li present first. Our interviewee, Ms. Daniel Santos, is working at a taxi. It is a, a digital marketing agency that focuses on client-centric um, digital marketing, and it's a subsidiary under Digital First Media. And a taxi is across all na across the nation, from LA to New York. Um, they work with Barano Limited to automotive or um, home services and more. Uh, some examples are um, Toyota and actually Home Store. Um, the company falls under the industry of digital marketing and it's a pretty competitive uh, industry because of all easy access to technologies today. And um, they target on people using new media such as uh, smartphones, or tablets, and um, smartphones and tablets. And as mentioned before, that technology is one important factor in the industry, and as well as the uh, client-centric approach. Um, client-centric approach that is needed to make a customized um, work from a uh, from a request from customer. And lastly, some of the related uh, industries are uh, advertising agencies and search engines. Mm -hmm. um, for my part, I did an interview through a marketing lens. And one of the first ones we have are the four Ps, which are price, product, place, and promotion. And we, and then she uses these without even realizing that she's using them in the workplace. And she uses the SWOT analysis as well. And she uses this when she's helping her clients. And then she also uses customer service, which is a topic that we just went over in class the other day. And So during the interview, this is actually the kind of questions we asked her. It's not all of the questions we asked, but I wanted to list down the most important ones. And our questions kind of wanted to grasp the concept of, like I said, the four P's, um, how it is in the marketing field, and the difference between learning marketing in school and applying that in the, you know, the career sector. So for instance, one of our questions is, you know, how is the marketing world actually like compared to what you learned at school? And she mentioned that Marketing in the real world, applying all these concepts, you don't necessarily apply everything you do, but you do need to really grasp the full concept and gist of what marketing is, what you want to apply for. And like we mentioned, she did use all four P's, price, product, place, and promotion. And some of these questions just kind of wanted to really get the, you know, the whole grasp of the whole marketing field and what she learned in school and how she was able to apply it. So, Denise Santos is a current graduate from Cal Poly Pomona. She graduated with a BS in mar uh, marketing management. Uh, while at Cal Poly Pomona, she was involved uh, with a lot of clubs, such as Delta Sigma Pi, which she was a founder of. She still currently comes back and works with Delta Sigma Pi. Um, currently, uh, after graduation, she has been working in the marketing field, and, when, and she now works for Ad Taxi. So then it comes to what did we learn from this whole experience? Um, our interview questions were all very much so based on figuring out what it's like to be part of the marketing environment at the moment. Um, and we discovered that it is very simple. It's exactly like what we were expecting from class. Um, it's that you would be using the four Ps a lot and it, it's a constantly changing and adapting field. And so a big takeaway that we got from it was that if you don't learn what's new, if you don't take an active effort to get an understanding what's fresh in the marketing field, you will be left behind. So it's a very active field that you're continuously learning, but without the fundamentals, you'll be unable to be effective in the field. 
Yeah. Um, overall, this is our presentation. Um, thank you for listening to it. Thank you for looking at our presentation. It was actually really great, you know, getting to interview somebody in the marketing field. And it was a really fun uh, interview to do and kind of get the whole gist of how it is working in the field after graduation, after learning all these concepts in school. This is our group and hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. Okay. Thank you.